like five minutes extra every day. So you know what I'm saying? Just to chill and just go to the dining Here we go. With the Wayne dog. There we go. Dinner time for South Africa. So I'm editing this from far in the future. The Commonwealth Games is now done and dusted. And I've got a series of clips that were compiled on the lead up to the competition actually kicking off. So the first few clips that you've just seen on the 23rd of July, we uh, were transporting around the village in the little buggies. We went to the, uh, the main dining hall for the first time as well. Then on the next day, the 24th of July, me and Chad drove about 30 minutes to try and find an electric scooter for him to get around the village. It was a load of rubbish, it was a kid's run when we got there, but we ended up finding one the next day that I went and picked up for him that you will see later in this video. Okay, it's uh, two days before we race. We're going for a pre-race haircut at the village barber. Chaddy's going up first. This is just one of the buildings in the village. I'll show you a little quick look. Got some water. There's loads of these little cafe areas that just have loads of snacks, loads of drinks, smart water, coke. I don't know why there's coke in here. Get some fruit, some porridge. These flapjacks are great. They've they've run out of the uh, the non-fruit one. I'll try a fruit one. Wraps, yogurt. Little outside sitting area. And there's uh, some like, uh, I don't know, is that like the open ceremonies? I think they invite different nations. This right now is Bahamas, Canada, and Jamaica's like welcome. When I just saw Wales, India, and Pakistan have a similar thing. Dancing going on. Yeah, Chad's going to get a haircut this time. Uh, well, it's now booking, so I don't see why we can't both get one. And we're going to go do a little 2.4k swim. Tomorrow is the last session. All the pools close up one tomorrow. So we've got one session tomorrow. And then it's pretty fly day. Then on the 27th of July, just two days before the competition kicked off, we went for a little speedy set. I helped out Sajan train. Chad just done some small bursts of speed, some underwaters with Finn, some XYI dead starts, some stuff like that. And then later that evening, we had a team meeting where we distributed the caps, all arena caps, 3D wave caps, 3D soft caps, aquaforce caps, ultra caps, and even some standard silicones, the girls with a lot of hair seem to like. We're at the pool again. We've got uh, six little speed spikes today. That is it. Shadi's over there. Gonna help Sajan out a little bit as well. Yeah, always good. Six, six, Sajan, six, six. Just done a little 50, 18 strokes of Sajan. session and he is rolling out and quite literally rolling out on his scooter. Is this allowed? Well not for me. But... Ch Chad, he's not allowed mate, come on. Let's go back to the village. Chad had a drug test waiting for him but also had a massage booked with the physio, the team physio. So he's got the um, Drug test or waiting where he has his physio. He'll get drug tested and they've got team bonding tonight. I'm going to go and find apparently a Mexican area. Oh, here we go. Hello. How's it? Hi, I'm Lynn. Physio is getting easy work today. Easy work. Got drug testing also? What do you say? Me and Eugene have sorted out some Mexican stuff in this little food truck, pizza next door. We've got a taco and a burrito each. We're waiting in line. Oh, look at this. I got drug tested now. I got blood. Alright. No, he was running late. He was running 30 minutes late for the physio, so that's why we walk. Post dinner, we've got a team me and handing out caps. And we've got a load. There you go. 
Trinity Michaela, 3D soft caps. There we go, right there. Oh, we've got Aquaforce wave caps, we've got all the caps in there. They're, they're, they're the uh, hard ones, they're not the 3D soft. 3D Ultra. 3D Ultra, there we go. The man knows his caps. You see the hats, Peter? Oh no, come on. Olivia, show me the hat, Peter's taking too long. No, that's wrong. No, that's wrong, Olivia. It's not gonna fit, it's actually the smallest cap I've ever worn. Oh, what? Oh, you look really good, Peter. Oh, oh the, the ops won't know what's happening. Hey, this one actually fits That's not sure. Sure. That's not going to fit all of this. What size is that? We're going to try and get Olivia in the large Aquaforce 3D wave cap. Come on. Oh, oh. Oh no. Then as I didn't get a haircut on the 28th of July, on the 29th of July I finally got my hair cut in the morning. Uh, we went for a little easy swim and we generally just had some more shenanigans in the village. I saw Ben and I also went into the Burnham City Centre to try and find Chad a bike chain. So uh, it's the day before we start racing. I've yep. just come and seen Sam in the Athletes Village. He's so given me a wicked haircut. So, how, can, how can people find you if they want a haircut? Uh, at scott 49 on Instagram. Yeah. Same as TikTok and Twitter. Check him out. Uh, you get a haircut if you're in Birmingham. Post haircut spotted a wild, a wild Ben Proud sitting alone. Very really comfortable, the day before racing starts. Down at 35 with Chaddy. Oh, he's gonna take over. Oh! He's gone. 35 now. Okay. Take your marks! Up. <laughs> Taking a look at the uh, swim down pool, these red blocks from the Olympics. Just plug to this end. Got a little ice bath. You want an ice bath now? So we've done training, last training session of the season, which is a crazy thought. And I've gone into town, just had a bike lock, I'm trying to find Sports Direct. I can't, but I have found. Official Burnham 2022 saw, which is pretty cool. Pretty sure this was Sports Direct. Bike lock secured. I hope you enjoyed the video. As always, do like, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.